Last week, we were all pretty jacked up to watch Justin Jefferson's return to the playing field. However, that only lasted 13 plays after he ran a route across the middle of the field, jumped up for a ball, caught it, but get or got drilled in the ribs slash chest area by Marcus Epps, the Raiders' safety. And, and then he would have to go to the sideline, get looked at, go back to the locker room, and then eventually was brought to the hospital for local or for just some evaluation. Make sure there was no internal bleeding, no broken ribs, which is basically what happened. Nothing was serious, so we avoided a significant injury. We're not going to miss Justin Jefferson for the rest of the year. No, no, no. He should be ready to go, okay? It was just a little bit of a bruise, and he should be fine. So what is Justin Jefferson's status for this Saturday's game against the Cincinnati Bengals? Well, let's find out. Before we do that, make sure to subscribe to the channel. It would be much, much appreciated. So Justin Jefferson's highly anticipated return to the field lasted just 13 plays on Sunday. A violent blow to Jefferson's midsection sent the receiver to a local hospital due to a chest injury. Fortunately for Jefferson... Okay, he avoided a significant injury, returning to Las Vegas Allegiant Stadium in time to see his teammates pull off a 3-0 win over the Raiders. Now, he's ready to resume his comeback. Here's what Jefferson told reporters today. He said, I feel pretty good. Okay, just with the hit and the things that were going on after the hit, we kind of had to go into precaution. We had to evaluate what was going on with my body. It definitely was a tough period of time, of course, wanting to come back after seven or eight weeks and wanting to be part of the team, making plays out there. But the situation and the circumstances that happened, I had to be taken out of the game, right? That was just what had to be happened. You could tell he was visibly in pain, at least a little bit. Goes off to the sideline. He's like, I, I feel fine, but it definitely hurts a little bit. Let's go get this checked out. So that's why he went to the hospital. Now, Given time to recuperate, it appears as if Jefferson will be able to play in Week 15 for a Vikings team that certainly could use his contributions. Now, he told reporters today nothing is affecting him related to the coll uh, collision, clearing his path to Saturday. Here's what Jefferson said. This week is a new week, and I'm definitely looking to have a great game. Now, the Vikings will undoubtedly need Jefferson in a pivotal game against the Bengals, who will welcome Minnesota to Cincinnati with an identical 7-6 and six record and similar playoff aspirations. Now, with veteran backup quarterback Nick Mullins set to make his first start Saturday, I'm sure, okay, that he will be happy to know his team's best catcher, best pass catcher will be able to suit up. So Jefferson said, hey, look, I'm playing this week. I'm good to go, and that is all I needed to hear. Justin Jefferson is back with the Minnesota Vikings. Hopefully, he stays on the field longer this time than he did last Sunday. You guys can let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Drop a like and subscribe to the channel. It would be much, much appreciated. Have a great rest of your night, folks, and Skull Vikes.